Are you, are you a senator? I am. Uh, I understand that there is a restriction on uh, hi, there's a restriction on uh, students uh, carrying firearms at certain uh, certain uh, campus events. PorcupineRealEstate.com. Um. So, I'm here to have a go at uh, filming a student government meeting at UCCS, the University of Colorado Springs, uh, University of Colorado at Colorado Springs. The, uh, this university is uh, perhaps uh, more open and tolerant than uh, the, some. The, uh, there is a degree of allowance for uh, uh, firearms carry on, on campus. I think this may have been imposed by state law or a uh, you know, court case or something like that, uh, but it's better than most places uh, in the university context. And uh, I have some other questions I'm going to ask. Uh, let's see what happens. Are you in the student government? I am, yes. Oh, question. Uh, Senator? I'm the director of finance. Okay. Yeah, so I'm in the executive branch. Question for you. Sure. Um, I have read that, um, the uh, according to your website, there is a restriction on filming lectures uh, unless you get permission. Uh, I guess if you're not a senator, maybe you don't always take positions on things, but do you personally support this, this restriction? Um, to record lectures? Correct. Um, I think as long as the professor permits it, yeah, go ahead, go for it. Uh, if, a pressure, if a professor doesn't permit it, or doesn't want it to be filmed, uh, because he's trying to keep it from the, from the public from knowing what he's, what he's doing, mm -hmm. uh, should, what should happen to the videographer? Mm, yeah, I don't know. I think it's really hard to determine intent just from recording a lecture, so I really don't know. You'd probably have to take it on a case-by-case -case basis. All right. Yeah. I appreciate your time and transparency. What was your name again? It's Dave Ridley, RidleyReport.com. Sorry, I always have to give Bob Dole handshakes. It all happens. All right. Thanks much. Enjoy. Take care. You were the scribe? No, it's uh, RidleyReport.com. It's like a poor man's TV station. Oh. I'm based in New Hampshire, but I, I, I'm from Colorado Springs, basically. So sometimes I'm here visiting. And cool. I'll cover any government meeting I can. All right, thanks. Absolutely. Are you in the student government? I am, yes. Uh, question for you. Are you a senator? I am. Uh, I understand that there is a restriction on, uh, hi, there's a restriction on uh, students uh, carrying firearms at certain, uh, certain uh, campus events, and probably it extends to average people as well. To what extent do you support this restriction? Uh, I'm going to allow my fellow senators <laughs> Cinco. Yeah. We need you in here, please. Thank you. All We're right. currently about to start a Senate meeting, so we can't. We don't really have time for it. Gotta go. All right. Have fun. So I should note that it was um, about 18 minutes before the, the meeting was supposed to start when you heard uh, that person say, "Oh, the meeting is about to start." <laughs> transacted the Live Free or Die State's first home sale for Bitcoin? Well, it was this guy, Mark Warden at PorcupineRealEstate.com. He and his experienced team of professional, responsible activists want to get you in the perfect New Hampshire home. Escape that authoritarian spit pit where you're living now. Visit PorcupineRealEstate.com.